have been on Discord for the past few months, you probably know that Discord now has themes. But if you haven't heard of it, I'm going to explain everything that you need to know in this video. So let's get started. First off, let's go to our user settings, go to appearances, and look at that badge. Yep, this is a nitro only feature. So yes, you'll need Discord nitro in order to use these themes. And I promise if you stick around until the end of this video, I'm going to show you how to get these themes for completely free, because why not? So let's preview these themes, and as you can see we have a nice selection of themes to choose from. We have light mode and dark mode themes, they look pretty nice. And I'm just going to scroll through them here. So I forgot to say this, but I'm here on uh, Discord's subreddit, and I forgot to mention that if you scroll through all of these and add Nitro, you unlock a secret theme right here, which is this one, it's just a light mode theme, but yeah, just just wanted to say that so yeah how this feature evolved so first things first this quarter of obviously started with the standard dark and light theme but then they added this staff only feature where you could change the color of your background which is kind of weird to be staff only but uh yeah and you're probably thinking that they will use the staff only thing for us non nitro users and use the themes feature for nitro users but sadly this feature of themes is replacing it all so yeah sadly no so now how do we get these themes for free well go to the first link in the video description that will be bencord.dev this is the official website for Ventcord, and by the way, Ventcord is a client mod, and client mods are against Discord's terms of service. And uh, basically, there's a small chance that you can get your account banned, but if you proceed with caution and be careful, you should be fine. And also, Discord only bans accounts that use like plugins that could spam Discord's API. So with that in mind, let's download Ventcord right here. And of course, I'm going to download the exe. And after that, make sure you have your Discord client closed. If you have no idea what stable BTP or Canary means and you just download Discord from the website, then choose this stable right here and click on install. It should say patch successfully. And now we can restart Discord by pressing the button right there. And after 10,000 years, we can go to our user settings. And now you can see Vanguard right here. Now there's one more step left and it's go to plugins, type in fake and you can see fake nitro right here. You can already tell where this is going and click the fake restart button. And if we go back to our user settings, go to appearances. Look at that. We can just choose our theme. Look at that. Just, yeah, we could, I mean, look, I can go to whatever server I want. It's there. Yeah, I can just choose whatever thing I want and look at that. I don't I don't have nitro guys. Look at my account. I <laughs> have nitro. And I mean since we have fake nitro, we can just go to the best server on the planet. Um and I don't know, we can just send an emoji. Look, um an emitted emoji. Uh well, not this one for the bajillionth time. I don't know why I'm sending this emoji, but look at that. You get nitro. I, I I mean I send the emoji. This is not a gift. This is just I'm, it's emoji. It's, it, yeah, I don't have nitro on my account. It's that's the power of client mods, everyone. Now, if these themes are not enough for you, then I have a separate video on showing you how to install custom themes on Discord. But I did use better Discord, and we are using Vancord. So quickly, I'm going to show you how to install custom themes with Vancord. So. The second link in the video description will be this themes page right here and i'm just going to go ahead and search up youtube because i mean why not i'm a youtuber so yeah let's click right here and you would normally download right here but since we are using vencord we need to click on source and if you don't see any vencord installation right here you need to look for a theme.css file so i'm going to check my theme collection and they should be this right here and then we'll click on raw and this should be uh, raw.user.github user content stuff just copy that bad boy then we go right here to themes then online themes then paste in your theme and boom there we go custom 
thing. I mean, look at that. That that, lo that looks actually pretty good. Now let's say this is too much for you. Well, to uninstall this custom theme, we can just go right here. Boom. But if you want to get rid of Vanguard and not getting on the ban list of Discord, <laughs> if it ever happens, I'm going to show you how to uninstall Vanguard. So first things first, close your Discord client. Let's go back to the Vanguard installer. Click on uninstall. And there we go, successfully unpatched. And now if we go back to Discord, and wait for it to load, look at that, we have no more, we're back to the old thing where we need to find hydrate. <laughs> so I was doing research on this video and I tried to find information on Discord's articles and I searched for themes, mm, nothing, uh, not really interesting, color, Ooh, but the cream of the crop is Discord appearances. And here it here is the article, but then TikTok my subscriptions customize perk Discord roll FAQ. What does Discord appearances have to do with TikTok live subscriptions because Spice perk Discord roll FAQ. <laughs> I mean, let's just take a look at this. Uh, uh, I don't know. I don't know. So, uh, <laughs> eventually I found it, but uh, yeah, it's a, this is a great article. I'll put a link in the video description. But TikTok live subscriptions. What does that have to do with Discord appearance? <laughs> It's p I'm going to end the video here. It's better. Thank you for watching. <laughs> Subscribe to all the YouTube stuff. Uh, join the Discord. I don't know. So, uh, yeah. The Goodbye. See you later. Uh